Leave me a set trip and let everybody know your name and where you from. Yeah, man, y'all niggas know what the fuck my name is, nigga. It's Fifth, nigga. Fifth boy, man, for the rap, motherfuckers. You feel what I'm saying, though? Giuliano for your bitch. I'm on from the five, man, that fish block, man. You know what the fuck going on, that Lee ass shit. Yeah. Fifth boy, Mr. Fo Loco, oh, man. man. It's been a long time, man. Oh, man, why you gotta bring that up? <laughs> oh, yeah, we're gonna talk about all that. I used to hate that shit with John. Eight man. years later, man. Eight, Eight years bricks. later, man. Let's talk about that, kid. Nigga, no missing tooth, no scratches. Came out that bitch on skate, man. Never took a snack, never took a kick the box, none of that. Niggas know what the fuck going on, nigga. I've been to Luke, Lev, Mansfield, Lake Erie, Trumbull, nigga, County, the Deuce, the real Deuce, 22nd, nigga. Niggas know what the fuck going on, nigga. Fresh out like I never fucking left, nigga. Whole lot of ink on me, nigga. Spent a couple of Debbies on this shit. I sure want about nothing, man. Eight bricks, man. I sure want about nothing, man. Free my Cody. Got out, caught a few bodies, nigga. You know I send that nigga soups every week. You feel me, man? I'm about to just apply some pressure, man, on this music shit. Plead the fifth on the way, man. Later on this year, around the winter time and shit, I'm gonna drop that. Just drop the EP eight years later, man. Video out. About to do these videos for this heart bleeding, this compressor and shit. Getting this shit together, man. I don't know what the fuck going on. Shit. So you say you did eight. So you can't you talk about that? What you going in for? Shit, you can pull that shit up on the internet for real and shit like. This shit ain't no scripted, weird shit. Like, niggas already know I was terrorizing out this bitch when I left. You feel me? I had like 18 drug trafficking charges. You feel me? I kept getting caught with the bag. <laughs> shit. I had this, uh, it was a case and shit on the fire. My young niggas <clears throat> was motherfucking about to go rob a nigga and shit. Took a nigga down and shit. Nigga tried to reach. They done aired the bitch about three, four times. Nah, for real, for real, I ain't even had <clears throat> shit to do with that. <clears throat> my nigga came down my way on Lee after they left for a half. And she ain't came to pick me up because I had a lick of oh, So you just did hate for some shit you ain't even had nothing to do with. The streets. The motherfucking streets, man. That's what I'm saying. Like, that's why I don't fuck with niggas now. Like, niggas barely see me and shit. Like, I wasn't tripping though, you feel me though? Because my mama crying behind that motherfucking glass. Like, you gone. You better tell on them you gonna pick them over me. Man, shit. Mama, get up out of here, man. I'm gonna catch up with you. I'm gonna send you some jail flicks. Shit, man, you feel me? I gotta get this shit together, though. I can't play like that, you feel me? I love all my Cody's, man. Ain't none of my Cody's ever tell on me, man. And I never tell on none of my Cody's, man. That just ain't the type of nigga, type of shit we be into when shit round my way on the fire. Like, nigga, my Cody Mickey, my Cody Dollar, my Cody Rodney, my Cody, uh, the fuck else was on my case? I had so many fucking Gully. How many fucking Cody's I had? Quick, Lil Rio, rest up quick, rest up Rio. All my niggas, man, I had like 10 Cody's though, on 10 just separate cases though. But shit, yeah, them niggas had came to grab me and shit. <clears throat> my voice fucked up. Them niggas came to grab me and shit. I had a little hundred lick in EC. I want about to hop on the bus. What year was this? This was, uh, this was 2010. I'll see what the fuck that say, man. Free gully, man. What the fuck going on? Shit, you gotta call back, though. But, uh, nigga, um, that was in EC. That was in 2010 and shit. I had a lick in EC that called at the Mr. Heroes and shit. For 100, I couldn't, I couldn't go up there and shit. My car was fucked up. So when they came down to pick me up, and a little blue Malibu and shit. I tell him like, shit, uh, shoot me up here. My nigga Lurch told me though, like, bro, don't, don't go on that plane and shit, bro. Them niggas hot. They been shooting niggas all day. But I'm hearing the shots. When we in Park Place trapping, I'm hearing the shots all day. But I already know how my young nigga is. And shit. I know he blowing shit, so I'm just laughing. Like, he terrorizing this bitch. He on the run. I tell him shoot me up there. We go up there. I hit the play. I was sorry too. He wanted on credit. I was sorry. Hit the play. Come back down. Get a mile from the pizza spot. We shoot back up Lee. Man, out the blue and shit, I see uh, the vice coming down the one way and shit. They look in the car. 
I'm in this bitch with my hood hoes too and shit. Kieran and Dominique and shit. So I'm in the middle. They on the side of me and shit. So when we pull in the alley cut and shit, I tell them pull up so I could pull. I hop out and bounce, man. They hop in the trash can. You feel me? They get away and shit. Nigga, me and Mick go to a band, though. You feel me? They had a dog. Try to send that bitch. Shit, after that, it was a wrap. You feel me? I had got out at first and shit. They had put me on house arrest. I was at Duke's spot. Like, I was already living by myself and shit. My nigga Gucci house. But I was at Duke's spot. She told me I can't fuck hoes in the house. Can't play the PlayStation. I'm, I'm grown as fuck. I got grounds. I'm shooting shit. I'm out of here. Cut the bracelet. Took him on the run for about a brick. That's why I made kick those shawty and uh, for loco and shit. How you get the name Fifth Boy and what does it mean? Shit. I got the name Fifth from my brother and shit. My brother Roseanne and shit. That nigga just gave me Fifth and shit when we was thinking the names and I was like 10 and shit because I was so thirsty to claim the five and shit. Like, I used to be stealing bikes and shit and spray paint, spraying that shit everywhere in the hoods, getting jade for this shit. Riding down Lakeview, spraying fifth boy from the five. Nigga on Rockland, fifth boy from the five. And EC, fifth boy from the five. I'm tagging shit, like, weird shit. A young nigga side. And shit, they gave me that name, fifth. How long you been rapping? And who was one of your biggest influences? Shit, I've been rapping since I was like seven on the playing side, but on the serious side, like getting in the studio, it's probably about. So I was like 12 and shit. I used to be recording at this Lakeview nigga named, uh, what was that nigga named? D? Yeah, D House and shit. I think that was his name. Yeah, and shit. My biggest influence and shit. You know my nigga Goo Wop. Big Goo Wop, man. You know I fuck with my nigga Gooch, man. Real street nigga, man. I gotta fuck with some real street niggas, man. That nigga had hits in the streets and still had a barley type shit. Like, that's how I relate to and shine with all that. Oh, you got bricks and. All this, oh, I had jumped off the porch in a yacht and a helicopter. Not with none of that. Tell me about a fin rental, a Montana van, a barley, a soda, and they only come back 1.2, you feel me? Shit like that. That's the type of shit I relate to. Bro. Shit, I only had like one mixtape on the internet and shit, that piff and shit when I came home. I mean, when I, uh, when I first started rapping and shit on the internet, but in the streets, like through the hoods and shit, I already had like four, five mixtapes. If niggas hip, like, if niggas, niggas that really know me and shit know about the Super Throw shit, Solo Dolo, Polo Mission, Welcome to Beachwood, all type of old mixtapes, Chalk Zone, but them bitches won. That was before I even start fucking my niggas, like, up the way and in the heights and shit like that and shit on the music side. That was back when I was just on my hood shit, rapping all the niggas beats and pitting shit out in the hood, but band camp on that pip, that was the only one I had and shit before I got locked up. How do you feel about local artists in Cleveland and the music scene in general? Shit. Local artists in the city and shit. I fuck with niggas though. That's just me though. Me personally and shit. Like, nigga Q Money got his way right now. He fucking it up. And my nigga Root, Free Root of Bang, you feel me? That's my nigga and shit, you feel me? Since way back when and shit. Plus, we walked that yard together and he came out and glowed up something crazy. He saw that he locked back up. You feel me? Uh, of course, my nigga Chapo. I fuck with my guy and shit. He got a crazy, weird following. My nigga Doe. Rip got it going. You feel me? Like, I fuck with a lot of niggas in the city. Like, niggas be going in. I just be feeling like, like, niggas in the city, like, be hating on each other and shit. Niggas don't be wanting to see niggas win for real. So niggas don't link up. Or niggas pride be so much in the way niggas be on some I ain't about to fuck with that nigga I got my own little glow or I ain't about to dick ride that nigga cause he gonna look like if I promote him or help him he a motherfucking I'm a dick ride or something so you feel me I just be on some man shit for real that's why I stay to myself for real I be doing my own little thing and shit cause I already know how niggas be acting for real what was the second question though I mean after that how you feel about the music scene in, in general? Shit, the music scene in general going. This bitch lit. Everybody and their mama getting signed right now. Shit, you got the 55 bad nigga got a deal. YFL Kelvin got a deal. Q Money got a deal. Doe got a deal. Shit, Rip probably got a deal on the low. Ain't no telling shit. 
this bitch going for real. Like, shit, I feel like we didn't know Atlanta, but I just feel like niggas got to start repping Cleveland. Do I still feel like niggas be dick riding these other niggas so much and shit trying to be Chicago niggas or Atlanta niggas? Like, bro, nigga, shit savage up here and shit. Nigga ain't got to be doing no weird shit, you feel me? Like, nigga, do your own thing and shit. You feel me? Just do your own thing and shit, nigga. We gonna glow up ourselves, man. What y'all looking at? So who are you doing business with now? And how did you meet Double Boy? Shit. Shit, you feel me? I mean, I'm doing business with a few people and shit, though. Right now. You feel me? Just linking with shit like nothing under paperwork or no contract or nothing like that and shit, though. But you feel me? You feel me? I got my guys. You feel me? These my hood niggas. Mostly all my niggas locked up and shit with my egg be the shit. You feel me? My egg be the business, man. You feel me? I'm trying to take this shit off and shit. And I be fucking with my rubber band money gang niggas. RBMG and shit. Mostly all them niggas I've been knowing and shit. Like, though I've been knowing since back day. You feel me? Johnny, I met in the joint. <clears throat> Goonie, I've been knowing that nigga. You feel me? Shark, I've been knowing that nigga. A lot of them niggas I've been knowing and shit, so I've been fucking with them and shit, so that should be cool. <laughs> right now, I'm just trying to push my brand, you feel me? I'm trying to get my name back out that bitch, you feel me, though? Because a lot of these niggas, man, these niggas think this shit a game. Like, a nigga be talking about that shit, but he ain't really with that shit. Like, I don't be feeling that. Like, if you got grams, man, shit, come serve or something, then. Like, if you really bought that shit, if you really... Pitting that shit up on niggas and shit, you play with them sticks and shit. Let me see some, let me hear something on 19 Action DM, man. Niggas be talking all that. I ain't with none of that shit, you feel me? Because I'm really taking them risks, you feel me? Eight bricks later and shit. I'm 24, 25, you feel me? I'm trying to, I'm still out this bitch trying to get over the hump. You feel me? I ain't faking, so with the faking shit, I don't be with that shit. Where do you see yourself at in the year being home? Shit, on a fucking flight. I'm already doing that though, but shit, I pose it. Oh shit, in a year, I've been out going on two months. I got like 30 plus songs, one video, two radio interviews, doing this little interview. Got another, I'm gonna do this compressor video next week. You know, I'm chasing, man. By next year and shit, man, I'm trying to be solidified, man. You feel me? It's, Fuck the hardest nigga in the city, man. Just, you feel me? Level up. Fuck the local. Fuck underground. I'm talking about main stage shit going, you feel me? Like, you see, I'm thugging. Shit, I'm out this bitch. Motherfucking T and some Nike. A whole lot of ink and a stick. You feel me? Shit, this shit gonna look crazy next year. I got a couple dollars. This shit gonna go up. So let's talk about this eight years later, little mixtape you just dropped. Oh yeah, motherfucking eight years later, man, the EP and shit. I dropped that for real. Like a lot of shit I've been doing, man, been rushed, man, because when I came home, my nigga had got killed and shit. So it it fucked me up. Like I was, you feel me? I was nigga. I've been pushing shit because that nigga left. You feel me? And I know that nigga wanted me to win so bad. You feel me? So even the video, the eight years later video, the, when I was fresh out of jail, when I first came home, I like way rushed that because nigga in the process of me recording, niggas called me while I'm at the open house to tell my nigga done died and shit. So it fucked me up. So I was tired of waiting and shit. I was impatient as fuck. My nigga project was about to come out. He telling me like it ain't marketed right, it ain't promoted right. I'm like, fuck that shit, drop it. You feel me? So that whole EP dedicated to my nigga Quick Vans and shit. So how do you feel about the industry right now? And this, um, anybody you fuck with in the industry? Is there anybody you would like to work with? You feel me? I fuck with, uh, I fuck with, there ain't too many industry niggas I fuck with and shit because it'd be so fake. But that nigga, young boy, he a dog. Lil Baby a dog. Of course, my nigga Gates a dog. Feel me? It's a couple of niggas and shit I fuck with. Young Nudie and shit, I fuck with that nigga heavy. But like industry motherfuckers and shit, I don't be with that fake shit, man. I don't. That shit be too watered down for me and shit. Like, maybe one day and shit, I cross over like my nigga Gooch, man. But I don't know. Not right now. I'm in the trenches right now. 
So what separates you from most artists? <clears throat> There's two things that separate me from most artists. Like, on a whole scale, I really know how to rap. Like, a lot of niggas just be using hella auto-tune or they gonna finesse it to just catch a catchy little drip on a track, man, that's going or shit. It might be, it might be. I don't take nothing away from niggas' craft, man, because if a nigga winning and shit, I don't, I don't care what bag you got and shit. If you, you taking off and you glowing up with it, you feel me? Go ahead, catch your cut. You feel me? But I'm talking me personally and shit. Like, I know how to rap. Like, I ain't got to use no effects on my voice. I ain't got to motherfucking... I ain't got to shake nothing. You feel me? I ain't got to... You feel me? I ain't got to do none of that type of shit. Plus, I'm really in the trenches, though. A lot of motherfuckers don't be in the trenches. They know some niggas from the trenches that are going to vouch for them. Because they clout chasing. But no, you really can't. Uh, free my nigga bossy. That's the only niggas call my phone for real, man. If it ain't been, it's my jail, niggas. But, nigga, they cloud chasing this shit, so street niggas, real street niggas vouch for them. But no, I'm really with that, though. Like, I'll pull up on you, I'll serve you, I'll blow you, I'll fuck your bitch. I do all that, like. You been rapping for a long time, but you been gone for eight years, so. Man. Like, what was your high points in your career since you start rapping at? What makes you just feel like you can just do that eight and come back right on top? Shit. Always Fit right in with the fuck they got going on right now. Shit, nigga always had the gift for this shit. Like, like I can I can I can move any type of person. Like I don't give a fuck if you're a street nigga, a college motherfucker, a fat bitch, skinny bitch, it don't really matter. Like, I got some shit. I got some shit to say, you feel me? <laughs> I got some shit to say, you feel me? Like, high points, you feel me? I done made it on TV, you feel me? Of course, that logo shit. I shit not hit all type of broadcasters and news, television, you feel me? Shit like that. Then I made it in the Source magazine. <clears throat> made it a little article in XXL. You feel me? I had some cool shit, though, but I don't like dwelling on the past. I like focus on right now, you feel me? Like, what I'm about to do right now, like applying pressure. Cause that's what niggas get caught up in, man. Just thinking, oh, I got a hit. Or I did this, man. So I'm solidified hell and all. That shit got to keep coming. So I got to keep coming hits. Keep dropping fire tapes, man. Keep fucking with solid niggas doing solid shit like I've been doing, man. And shit going to motherfucking go my way, you feel me? So speaking of now, uh, since you've been home, it's like a typical day for fifth boy. Shit. A typical day, man. All I do is work, man. Like... Nigga, work, grind, studio, business meeting, radio interviews, shows, everything is work, man. If I ain't writing, I'm listening to beats. <clears throat> I'm motherfucking setting up, I'm setting up accounts and shit. I'm copywriting shit. I'm getting logos printed out. I'm getting merchandise, memorabilia, shit like that. I'm hopping on flights. You feel me? I gotta get back to the bag. You feel me? Like, then I got a whole ass daughter and shit. I be trying to take care of her shit right now. I ain't been seeing her and shit because me and her mama on some bad terms. But you feel me? Like, I'm busy 24 7. Like, motherfuckers be sorting it because I don't pick up the phone. You see how many times this bitch didn't run. Like, I'm always busy, so I can't call you. I can't text you. I can't, I can't sit here and tell you how much I love you. None of that type of weird shit. Like, I'm trying to get to a bag by next year. I'm trying to have that not not. Fuck that fake knot, two bands with hella 20s with 100 on the top and hella ones. I want that big bag, man. You feel what I'm saying? I'm trying to do it. <clears throat> Damn, my shit, dog. Shit, you can hit me up on um, iTunes at Fifth Boy, 5TH Space BOY. You can hit me on the ground at Fifth Boy, 5TH BOY underscore. Hit me on Twitter. The fifth Juliano, 5th, J U L E E O N O. Hit me on SoundCloud, fifth boy, 5th, B O Y. Spin Rilla on the way. Apple Music on the way. All the motherfuckers, Spotify, iHeart, Satellite, all that shit on the way and shit. I'm just getting that shit together right now and shit. But I'm gonna flood the streets for sure.
I'm looking for that plead to fifth, though. I'm apply some pressure. No, All right, man. Man, before we get up out of here, let me spit some for us. Shit. Oh, I got some shit, man. Some shit off the top. So this shit really how I be feeling, though. Like, see, when they listen to my music and shit, my tape or a single, like, I want you to really listen to that shit, man, because that shit be real life, though. I don't be just making up some shit in fantasy land, like, ooh, this shit sound cool. You feel me? I'll throw a little bit of drip on that shit, though, but I don't be just, oh, Maserati, it is. Yeah, brick, man, dude. I don't be. This shit be real life, though. What I say? These nigga pillow talking to them Thadianas, what? That puss ain't wasabis. Why he eat it? Many niggas be wild and he cuffing runners. Need to turn on his sirens. Autopilot, throw that foreign and cruise. Bird on his head like a party. Through, I was fresh out the zoo. I was caged in the room. Don't care if I'm sick, but I bring me no soups. Blood on my shoes, I ain't wearing no lubes. Bunts and bruises, all that shit I've been through. I wear that Glock, but I'm keeping my cool, cause it came with a cool and they see when I shoot it. Snow they on the news, turn to a movie. All of these clips made me feel like director. Young and say, how you work to compress it? He used to work, but it's not bad, it's his favorite. Gated the Sevens, we walking on gaming, been stacking. Benjamin starting to look like a Cayman. Down in the payment, we're still getting payments. A different type gated community, counting the eulogy. Foolery, hopped on this dance, start rehearsing some poetry, look for immunity. Got 23, wish that on no one be heated, some fuckery real. She pop a cell, I'm a feel. Free little Bobby, he can't get a heel. Ain't got a hundred, but we're at least a meal. I got bass in the street, fuck, I need with a deal. Chill, my jury on chill. Refrigerator when I go cop the braces. Selling babies fresh up the incubator. She eat the babies, I just bought her some cable. Hood uh, nigga, but you grew up in Maple. She just ain't adding up. Babe, mama, she a duck. I'm fucking on models. I'm stepping my bracket up. Ooh, that shit gonna hurt me in court. Here a few sources, my Juliana looking gorgeous. Little bitches disappointed cause they ain't got walls. I guess they ain't paying on that mortgage. Shit, you know, soft shit.